Assalamualaikum everyone, yes I'm back with a new video. I stopped at a random on the way dollar store. This is the dollar store bag. As you can see it has items priced at a dollar and two dollars. Here is the address. So the first items are these adorable snack pillows. As you can see all the snack cushions were covered in this plastic which I removed. These snack cushions are really nicely filled and plump. There are no zippers. It just has a seam closing and holding the stuffing in for a clean look. It has a snack design only on one side. It is soft and squishy but only downside is that the outer cover is made of polyester so it's super hot. This will be great for winters only. Now the cushions are essential to the comfort of any space whether it's home or an office as it can improve the look and feel of your space by adding both a sense of warmth and creativity given the many designs cushion covers can come in. The cushion pillows pair perfectly with any seating providing extra padding as well as visual appeal. These are suitable for the young, the old and everyone in between. Next up I have these glorified bubble wrap. Hey you! Bored of sitting around just on your phone getting lost in social media? Well don't worry! Boredom is a state of mind and we want to break you out of it. Just pop it. Use these small flexible silicone toys that resemble bubble wrap with little blisters you can pop in and out. Comes in a variety of colors, shapes and sizes. Keep boredom at bay. Pop it offers the fun of bubble wrap without the waste. All you do is press the bubbles down and they make a pleasant popping sound. It is reusable and washable. Now let's hear some popping sounds. To be very honest, I regret buying these. One side is easy to push and makes a nice satisfying sound, however the other side makes barely any sound, is significantly harder to press down. Sometimes they even pop back up after you press them. See? Boo. On to the next item. When you light this rose flower musical birthday candle, it will bring smiles to everyone's faces. These come in a variety of colors. This flower musical birthday candle first appears as a closed flower bud. This flower candle is placed on a white plastic foot that can be used with food which can be easily set right on top of the birthday cake. If you don't want to do that, you can just set it aside next to the cake. Lighting the center of the candle will start the chain reaction starting with a large sparkler-like flame. The small individual candles are then lit by the large center flame. Once the smaller candles are lit, the flower bud opens up and begins to slay the happy birthday tune. The flower birthday candles are made up of a center bud and eight outer petals. Each of the petals holds a single minuscule birthday candle. The white petals catch the dripping wax so it doesn't get on the cake. The only downside of this product is that it is a one-time use and it's not reusable. So another item from the dollar shop has to be these instant pull bowls pull ribbons. This is what they look like. At first a pull bow doesn't look like much. A few pieces of ribbon that are bonded or linked together. It's flat long and doesn't at all look like a bow. But this isn't ordinary ribbon with a random pattern. This is a pull bow. Each weld or link of ribbon to ribbon is perfectly placed in just the right spot to transform a two-dimensional object into a beautiful fully formed bow. Here's how the magic works. Open the bottom of the bow to reveal the inner ribbons. Hold the bow between your thumb and forefinger. Slowly and gently pull the inner ribbons with the other hand. As you pull the inner ribbons, your bow will come to life. Gently pull these strips until the center of the bow comes tight. Don't over tighten it or else the bow will pop right off the end and it'll be ruined. Then using a glue dot, I will secure the beautiful bow on the gift box. 
Now at this stage, you can use the inner ribbons to tie onto your present or you can leave them loose or curl them to add flair to the bow. How to curl the ribbons? So easy. Just find the natural curl of the ribbon. Typically the shiny side of the ribbon will be on the outside with the dull side curling underneath and inwards. Firmly grip the base of the ribbon with your index finger and thumb. Use your non-dominant hand for this so your dominant hand is free to manipulate the scissors. Carefully hold the scissors open in between the blades and the handles with the sharp edges of the blades pointing away from your hand in an X shape. Using your thumb carefully yet firmly press the top of the dull side of the ribbon against the blade of the scissors. Taking great care to ensure you don't injure yourself, pull the ribbon across the blade of the scissors away from you. This pressure and movement will cause the ribbon to curl. Release the ribbon from under your thumb. If done correctly, the ribbon will pop out and curl upwards. This one is a large pull bow. These are made differently. You can see the links that are encased in a plastic ring, but the concept is the same. You separate the two larger ribbon pieces at the bottom and you pull the inner two smaller thinner ribbons. This big ribbon is really floppy when you take it out first, but just pull it gently and again don't go crazy with it because it will get all tangled up. But this makes a big beautiful bow. Now for this one I recommend that you definitely tie the backs of the tiny ribbons because of the way it is constructed. It will come loose a little bit easier. So this one you definitely want to tie off in the bag before you start to attach it to something. Now the other nice thing about this though is that because of the way it's constructed on the separate segments, you can adjust the puffiness and style of the bow and you can get it just the way you want it. Now no matter what type of instant pull bow ribbon you choose, with a simple pull you will get a perfect bow every time. The rest is up to you. Now that you've got your bow, use it to make your gifts, baskets and bouquets beautiful. You can use the banding ribbon to wrap the bow around an object or you can tape the bow to a gift and curl the ribbon for added texture. You'll love how simple and fast it is to make your gifts look grand. And we're done. So everyone, if you really enjoyed watching this video, you know what to do. In case you don't know what to do, please don't forget to like, subscribe, press the bell icon so you're notified of any future videos that I might post. Leave a constructive comment and share this video. I know, I know, it's a lot to do. But I really appreciate it. As always, thank you so much for your support and encouragement. Thanks for watching. Until next time, Allah is bye. Thank you so much for watching till the end of this video. If you want to watch similar videos, please check out the playlist right here. Or here. Check it out.